Good morning guys and welcome back to Velcro's YouTube channel. So we had a really, really special rescue this week and we just want to tell you guys a little bit more about it. Uh, but before we do that, we just want to remind you to watch the video all the way to the end, like the video and subscribe to our channel. All right, let's go check it out. On Tuesday night this week, Mr. and Mrs. DeVette who are shareholders at the Olifants River Private Game Reserve, alerted us to an African whiteback vulture that seemed to have got itself caught in what appeared to be a piece of old PVC piping. So having a look at the photos and assessing what seemed to be some serious damage, we realized that we need to get out there as soon as possible and rescue that bird. So on Wednesday morning, Kerry Walter and Becky Sabanda from Velcro headed out uh, to the area to go and uh, attempt to catch the bird to get that plastic off its beak uh, so that it would be able to eat and drink again. On the Wednesday, the team attempted to capture the bird and all our usual capture methods were considered. So this includes capturing closures, loose captures, uh, even a cannon net. But unfortunately, the methods that were used, we were, the team was unable to catch that bird. So on the morning of Thursday, Ben Miller, the local vet, was brought in and we decided to rather use a tranquilizer gun to dart that bird. Now, as far as we're aware, this is the first time that a vulture has ever been tranquilized with a dart gun, but with the extreme situation that we were in, it was decided that that would be the best method to capture this bird. Once the pipe was removed from the bird, we realized how skinny and dehydrated the bird actually was, and for that reason, he was immediately put on a drip. To make sure that he makes a full recovery, we also then brought him back to Velcro, where he was receiving a couple weeks of rehabilitation just to make sure he's perfect before we take him back to be released at the Willy Funks River Private Game Reserve again. We just want to give a special thanks to everybody that came out and helped us with this rescue and we want to give a special thanks to Mr. and Mrs. DeVette who originally alerted us to the bird, Nick Liebenberg, the warden of the Willy Funks River Private Game Reserve for allowing us to be on the reserve and catch the bird and then also to Ben Miller, the local vet who came out to help us dump. We also want to thank Lampopo Nature Conservation for allowing us to do this work in the area in order to make sure that we can serve as many vultures as possible in South Africa. Thanks so much for watching guys, we really appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video, we'd really appreciate it if you liked the video down here in this corner and if you want to see more of our videos, you can always subscribe to our channel over here. And then if you want to be kept up to date with what's happening on our channel, you can always uh, hit the alert button, which is also over here in this corner. All right. Thanks, guys. Cheers.